space here. I still have not expanded. He has. He has expansion going. Slightly saturated, so um, he really does have the upper hand right now. Plus he has this expansion blocked off, and he's not watching my other expansion that I believe he should be. He is taking down these rocks, though, so that way he can make a quick entrance to my base with those zeolots if he needs to. I've only got four zeolots, a sentry, and a sentinel guarding my base, but I do have quite a few 3DT, stalker, and quite a few zeolots in his base. I am making that observer now. And I'm building a couple more gates. I do have quite a few minerals stockpiled, and so I'm trying to get as many zeolots as I can with those. Um, I'm going to need to make a couple more pylons, and here they come. He's got a few... Stalkers and Zealots at his base, but not a whole lot of stuff. And he does have Void Rays incoming, so he is getting this uh, in the air. He is bringing in cannons into his base, and he still has not found my guy sitting up in his base. He does have those rocks down again. He has five cannons sitting there. And I am just mining away, waiting for these to come in. I'm going to warp in one more group of stuff. This I do have a pretty sizable force sitting in his base now. Um, most of it is ground, so if he gets a few of these uh, Void Ray, that could really slow this attack down. I do have six warp gates now. I do have a little bit of supply. Used up all of it, and here I go. I warped in mainly stalkers because I knew I needed to get some air protection. I'm taking these out first. And here comes the void ray and everything else. I go over. I'm focusing down the void rays right now, trying to get rid of those because those could be bad news if I lose all of my stalkers. I am warping in more stalkers because I, I don't get all the void ray. But he does not have enough ground forces to deal with this. So I do have three stalkers focusing on the last void ray. And I still have 3DT and a bunch of Zealots running around his base, going towards his probe line. He does have cannons throughout his probes, though. He did run all of his probes over to his uh, secondary base outside here, and he is running them off, so I didn't get very many probe kills. He still has 45 probes, so he's not in horrible shape. His base is going down, but he's really not in bad shape. Slowly taking down his pylons, taking down his cannons, trying to get clear out his base, warping in more stalkers here as much as I can afford. I do have a lot of minerals still, so I should be expanding right now. Um, to set this up for a longer game, I should send out for an expansion right now. And he is sitting up in my base with a bunch of cannons, He's destroying one of them so he can put a nexus down. All of his gateways are unmanned now. They can no longer produce guys. Unpowered. I have not moved into his probe line, but he does have sentries there cutting me off. He's making some more photon cannons. Still blocking the way with sentries. Trying to give himself some time to recover there. I see that he's doing all that, so I'm going to just run my forces that I have in my base straight to his front of his base, plus warp in some more stalkers in the back. So I've got a pretty sizable force now. Um, they're sitting right outside just in case his probes try to run out. exactly what they are doing right now, and they're going to run right into those zealots, so they have no chance of escape. So I have killed quite a few probes now, but he still has about 43 probes, so he's still doing fine. 43 should drop here in a second, I don't think this updates quite as quickly. But he does have a lot of money left over. There he goes, down to 28 now, so I killed about 15 probes there. I'm going to knock this nexus down. He's still producing probes in here. Warping in zealots, because again, I'm a little short on gas, but I do have a lot of minerals, so I'm trying to replace my forces with what I can afford. 
His main base and natural are pretty much dead now, but he is rebuilding very quickly inside my secondary high base expansion. Now I did see that the cannons were here a little bit earlier with that observer, but I really don't think that he has this much stuff here. I just think he has a few cannons. Um, I do have a pretty sizable army. If you look at the army tab, uh, I'm at 83, he's at 43, so I mean, it's, uh, I have a pretty good advantage right now, but my income is dropping because I have not expanded. I completely forgot about the expanding, and so I have no income currently. He is back to mining full, so he's definitely ahead of me there again. Another big misplay by me. I'm playing as if I've won this game already. I'm just trying to clean up. I have noticed that he hasn't been revealed yet, so... I know that he's built somewhere, I just don't know where. And if we look at my vision, you can see I did see those cannons. And now... My minerals are completely gone in my base, and I still have not expanded. I do have a prism, so I see that he has a bunch of stuff here. I'm thinking about setting up to do a drop. I need to take out his miners, if possible. I'm spending too much time on this. I'm not sending these guys back to my base yet. It's now getting shot down by these stalkers. He only has a couple, but... A couple might be enough to hold me off here. He does have quite a few cannons, though. So... And more cannons are coming. I do have a few zealots and a void ray. Decided to use that starport that I accidentally built, but now I am out of minerals. I don't think I've realized that I've completely mined out yet. Not to mention, um... I don't realize how much stuff he truly has. I'm waiting for to get regrouped here. Now I've realized that I have forgotten to mine. He has quite a few cannons, like I said, so I'm trying to focus those down, clean this up here. Those cannons are really wreaking havoc on me. I can't kill all the zealots. He does have plus one attack, which I have no upgrades on mine, so his are a little bit better than me. I just wasted almost all of my forces on that small attack and really only killed three, four zealots and maybe one cannon and lost almost all of my guys, so that attack was not worth it. If we look, he is still in the deficit as far as the units lost, but he has been mine, out mining me this whole game. Um, he has uh, five zealots, I have six, and a void ray, and a couple stalkers. I am trying to take this down here, but he is going to bring his stalkers up, so I have to run that guy away. I am now long distance mining from the gold because I failed to build when I needed to and I do not have enough minerals. I was hoping one trip would do it if I went to the gold and it doesn't quite give me enough minerals so now I have to do one more trip just so I can get a base back up. I do realize these rocks are down so I'm going to throw over here, regroup with my other units because this is all I have while he is continuing to mine, continuing to build, building his forces back up while I am long distance mining because I failed to expand when I needed to. I thought I had the game in, in the bag and he has pulled a complete 180 on the game and now has complete control. He's gonna catch these probes in, the, in long distance mining process and kill most of them off. So now I'm back down to 20 probes income again. It's very, very small. I'm trying to fight this off. I'm trying to get rid of these guys, but again, he has plus one upgrades, plus one armor, plus one shields, and I have zero, zero across the board. Pretty much lost everything in that battle now, and here he comes. This Void Ray is not going to survive very long against those. And now I do have a base up here, but again, he has cut off destroying my base. So it looks like he might come back from behind in this series here to make it 2-1 rather than going 3-0. So we're going to need a game 4 